How's it going guys? We're going to go ahead and review Trend Micro Antivirus Plus 2018. This is what the program looks like here. I'm using the free trial right now. If you want to test that out also, you can go to trendmicro.com. And when you're there, go ahead and click on products. Protect one PC. It depends on what you have. You have Windows, Mac. You can go ahead and... Uh, select here so I have windows so protect one PC or if you want to protect three of them you click on here I'm just gonna go ahead and click on protect one PC now notice here it's $29.95 I think they have it 25% off at this time I'm making this video from $39.95 down to $29.95 with that 25% off but we're testing it right now we're seeing if that price is worth it so if you scroll down here it is. We're right now we're reviewing the basic one, which is antivirus plus security. And if you notice here, um, it tells you what you get. So with plus security, we we can get one device protected for this for the price that I showed earlier. I'm sure if you select three devices, it's going to be more on the price. So it protects against ransomware. And if you all if you don't know what ransomware is, it's the type of uh, virus that goes into your computer and holds your computer hostage until you pay them a certain amount of money and even if you pay them they still might not give you your computer back but yeah it protects against that which is a very uh, a prevalent problem going on right now it's got machine learning technology safeguards against email scams that's as far as antivirus plus security goes uh, the other versions uh, have a uh, keeps children safe online feature Privacy on social media, fixes and optimizes systems, protects and manages passwords, secures and mo secures mobile devices. So we're going to review those later, but right now we're doing the basic antivirus plus security. To get the free trial, just click that right here on the free trial button, and uh, it's going to ask you to buy right away. I'm like, you want to try it first before you buy. Why are you trying to make me buy it so quick? So you click on continue to free trial, and um, Scroll down and select if you want it for PC or for Mac. They, they even take you to the installation process here. That's pretty cool. I got to give Trend Micro props for that. You see here is the installation. And you get to choose maximum security, internet security, or antivirus plus. And I just clicked on antivirus plus. All right, so here's the program right here. This is what it looks like. I like how they have a scan button right there. But the thing is, we don't know what type of scan that is when you click on it. I recommend you click on the downward arrow right next to oh what happened it closed on me trend micro closed on me I think it's updating okay so it had closed on me and there it goes again it closed again what is going on with it it just keep, keeps closing out and that's weird I think it's updating but I I've never seen an antivirus program actually close out completely while it's updating unless it's the actual software and not the virus definitions so it's back up now I, I think that's kind of uh, annoying how it closes down when you're up when it's updating but anyway it, here it is again I don't know what it was doing I, I think it might still be doing the update so that can be kind of annoying for it to close when it's updating like that but anyway here we are again what I recommend you do is click on the little downward arrow right next to the scan button and do a full scan. You always want to do a full scan. Don't do the quick scan, which we call it a cheap scan. But uh, looks like right off the bat, it starts searching for Trojan horse programs. Look at that, guys. Wow. Okay. Let's see what this download. Okay. So while that scans, we're going to go ahead and take a look at all the other features. So if you go to device here, come on running a little slow okay so right here um, you can uh, configure real-time scanning web filtering that's turned on automatically now mute mode temporarily stops non-critical notifications while you're still doing an important task so if you're gonna work on something and you know like if you're an editor or you know content creator or whatnot you use um, a program that's gonna you know you don't want to be bugged you can click on this configure button and you can go ahead and turn it on right here you see this big slider to the left 
And you could you could select if you want to turn it after off during two hours, four hours. You could make it turn off automatically. You can also disable Windows updates while you turn this on, which is pretty cool. You can actually terminate a program too. You can add it by clicking this button here, and then you select what program you want to um, add to terminate. So if you're going to work on something you don't want to be bugged by Trend Micro, you turn this on, which is a good feature because a lot of people complain about that. Like my antivirus keeps bugging me while I'm trying to work on this or a big scan is going on right at the same time I'm working on this to slow down my computer. So that's good to have that. I got to give them props for that. So privacy, uh, social networking protection is on. Uh, you can configure that. So it'll show you what internet so basically what it does let's go back at a glance uh, you can see which links are shared on popular social media sites and lead to safe or risky web pages so it can give you a heads up right there and you can install it on your browser for example I have Chrome right here you just hit the install button and it should take you to right here enabling the trend micro toolbar so you gotta install that toolbar on Google Chrome and it's called the safeguard um, so once it takes you to the web page scroll down and then click right here uh, click on how do I enable the toolbar and it'll tell you right here the way to download the toolbar is by opening it up right here with this link it'll be different for Internet Explorer but I'm doing uh, Chrome right now you click on that link and here it is the toolbar you click on add to Chrome It's going to ask you, click on Add Extension. When it's finished, here on the upper right hand corner, it'll tell you it's been installed. And there it is, right there, that icon right there. And right there, you can select rate links on web pages, mouse over, and then there's a settings button. So that's pretty cool. So you can have it right there. And for Internet Explorer, it might be a little different, but that's how you do it on Chrome. All right, let's go back to the program. So that's where we were, the social networking protection. Just click Configure to, to turn it on. All right, let's go back. Let's look, take a look at the data feature here. The scan is at 10% right now. I'm sure it's going to take a while. Uh, all right, so here the folder shield prevents ransomware from taking your files hostage. You click on Configure. So here is where it protects. Right now it's only out of the factory it protects documents and pictures. Click on the protect more button here and then you can select which folder where your files are at and then um, it'll protect them. And not out of the factory protect all connected USB drives is turned on right there. You can turn it off by unchecking that or checking it. Alright, so that's pretty cool how you can actually protect your folders from these ransomware viruses, man. It's important that you do because, man, once that virus got your files, it'll encrypt them and you can't get them back unless you pay them. So this is a very good tool here. I got to give Trend Micro props for uh, updating with the times because just a regular antivirus program that won't cut it. You need ransomware protection, guys. You do because that is the new, the new thing going on. All right. And then there's the family thing. But for that, you have to pay. Right now, we're using the basic version Antivirus Plus. If you want to use the family, I believe you have to get the internet security. Watch, let's click on it. It's going to ask us to, to probably buy the uh, internet security or the total security. Maximum security, that's where it comes in for the uh, parental control and protection tool. All right. And we will make a, a video tutorial on that also. But right now we're doing just this basic one. All right, so the scan is going through. It's at 10% right now. And that's pretty much it. I, I like the, the basic version here. If you don't have no kids, this is perfect for you, the basic version. If you have kids, you want to protect them, I recommend you uh, upgrade to the maximum security. We will be upgrading. I mean, we will be um, reviewing maximum security soon so be on the lookout for that video and we'll take a look at that parental uh, stuff and see how they do alright guys 
So that's pretty much it, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and uh, stay tuned for the next videos of Trend Micro, which is going to be internet security and maximum security. I'll see you soon in one of my other videos. Have a great night.